Good morning, everybody. It is the 26th of May, and uh, taking my dad up here to uh, what we call our gas well piece. There's been a, a big long beard that's been coming out here uh, pretty regularly on the, this week. It's been out for sure the last three mornings. Uh, yesterday morning it came out at 6.30. I have trail cameras kind of set up all around the food plot up there. And uh, I checked those cameras yesterday and was surprised to see this bird kind of doing the same thing each day. So uh, I'm excited uh, to get Dad up there. I actually took and moved that uh, portable blind that I had and I put it right at the point of uh, the brush up there that overlooks the field and the food plot where these birds have been coming out and I set up that strutter decoy out there with a uh, hen decoy sitting in front of that strutter decoy. So if they come out into that field anywhere, they're certainly gonna see that strutter decoy and that long beard that's been coming out there Seems like he's kind of the boss hog and isn't going to take to that strutter decoy being out there. So, uh, Dad might get to waylay a big old long beard right up here in pretty much our backyard. You've never killed a spring turkey, have you? Don't think so. Killed them in the fall, but not yeah, in the spring. I don't think so. So, we'll see. We're still after him here. It's getting right down to the wire. This 5 a.m. stuff is kind of tough on me, so. <laughs> Still waking up. Oh heck, I I can't hardly sleep. I'm so excited to get out to the woods in the morning. We'll see ya. We'll see you up there in the shanty. Okay, here's our setup, everybody. We got that strutter decoy with a breeder hen right here. We're gonna be in that shanty right there on the edge. These birds have been coming out usually right in this area or right over there in the corner of the food plot so we'll see if they come out this morning it looks like uh, we got some rain on the way maybe but we'll get settled in and hunt this bird kind of like a deer It's right on the brink. He comes back out. We can give it a try, but. I can't believe it's scared of that decoy. Go 
those heads are going to come right out to the decoys. turkeys that were too close. Well, we had three hens and that gobbler come right out here to the field where they've been coming the last three mornings and uh, that gobbler was not having that full strut decoy. He's obviously got his butt whooped a few times and he kind of stayed right on the edge of the woods and wouldn't come out. And those hens walked right out to the decoys and then he came back out and uh, we're going to try it. It's, it's like 60 yards to where he was, right by that trail camera. And Dad lifted up his gun with his hens standing 20 yards from us, and the hens obviously seen it and took off, and they all took off. These turkeys have really keen eyesight. I guess, because it was a very gentle movement. <laughs> They don't like a gun being pointed at them. <laughs> no. But I think uh, tomorrow morning we're going to do just a hen decoy. We're going to leave the full strut decoy at home. 
he didn't like that. Although, when he came back out to the field, you could see his head was more colorful. It's still pretty red. Yeah, but I think he was starting to get a little fired up. I don't know. Either way. I don't think he was coming out. Cause no, I think you're going to have to kill him right on the edge of the woods there. Dad was trying to get a beat on him, get a beat on him but he was standing right next to my trail camera. <laughs> Don't want any XRs in my trail camera. We might still be in the game. Got that decoy out of there, so we'll see. Well, then I uh, accept defeat this morning. We're gonna be back on them in the morning, and we're not gonna use the full strut decoy. That gobbler's a pansy ass. Wasn't looking for a fight this morning. That bird let all his hens go right out to that strutter decoy and carry on and he just stood on the edge of the woods and watched. Unreal. Dad probably could have put it to him. It was about 60 yards where he was on the edge of the woods, but it's a little farther than you like to shoot, but that gun could do it. But we'll, uh, Tomorrow morning, we're just gonna use a hen decoy. And uh, I think we'll be in business, so. Exciting hunt, nonetheless. The plan worked to a T, other than the strutter decoy.